Some fishing trips you rough it, but others, well, a little bit of luxury doesn't go astray. When Ryan had me out in the middle of Pemberton during winter, I knew I was going to need a soft bed and a warm room to defrost in after the fishing. Enter the Pemberton Hotel, set in some of the most beautiful country you're ever going to see. The Warren River flows close by and that means redfin perch, light tackle and canoes. Yes, as you've guessed, my canoeing skills aren't going to get me into a Goulburn Valley commercial. Oh, it's just, that was just the most graceful uh, entry to the water I've seen in weeks. But it doesn't matter because I'd borrowed this superb adventure kayak for the weekend. At first glance, you might think they're unstable because they're so light, but guess again, I tried to tip Ryan out of this thing so many times, not on purpose of course, but I just couldn't do it. Anyway, the idea here is to use small crawdad lures to flick into the snags, and all things being equal, score yourself a nice red fin perch or two. Yep. Well done, mate. Well done. What you do you reckon it is? Oh, I think definitely a perch. It's only a small one. You hit just, just as that lure came back to the boat. Yeah, it's a perch. Oh, it's not a bad one, mate. Not a bad one. Oh, now he's playing up. Oh, isn't that a very pretty fish? Come here. And here comes the sun. Anytime you're ready, mate, you can take it out the water. <laughs> Top work. Top there you go. Work. What a good fish. First fish. Now, they're an introduced species, the redfin perch. And as oh. such, the powers that be, mate, they don't want them to be in these rivers, do they? No, that's right. No, they are introduced and they're a bit of a pest, but it tastes nice on the table anyway. Well, so. this is the great thing about redfin perch because they taste a bit like King George Whiting, beautiful on the plate. You're not allowed to put them back, so every one you catch, you can keep. There's no bag limit. Oh, I think uh, you could go hard down here and you're doing the environment a great favour. What we're looking for is not necessarily the brighter side of the river. That can produce, but Ryan in particular has found that the darker side over here, while it's a bit cooler, to <laughs> pedal around it, it's not warm, but this is where most of the fish are going to be holed up, right against the bank. So you'll notice we're putting our lures under trees, sometimes in them, but anywhere there's a nice log or right up alongside the bank. And as one famous bloke called Blackjack told me in Karanara once, it's not the snags you can see, it's the ones you can't that are important. Oh, that cast deserved a fish, oh. Ryan. It's a yellow, uh, yellow fin? It's yellow a red fin. fin. A good it's red some fin. sort of fin. Nice, nice, nice. They don't fight overly well, but it's just the whole, the whole actual feeling of the fish coming up. That's a good fish, Steve. That's a top fish. Now you were saying here in the uh, Warren that the fish are actually getting bigger and not quite so plentiful as you've seen in recent years. That's right. I reckon the fact that people are actually keeping all the fish that they uh, catch here, it's giving a chance for the bigger ones to grow bigger. And yeah, there just seem to be more bigger fish now and less run fish. Ryan came down here about six weeks ago. As you're watching this, we actually did film it in late June. And so there's a lot of rain, a lot of water pushing down. And so the current's actually really kicking up. All this water flowing down beautifully has given us plenty of structure, but it means that the canoe's moving all over the place. So it's all about teamwork as usual with fishing. You go fishing with a mate, five minutes each on the paddle, five minutes each on the rod. One of you will do better, but that's what it's all about, having fun with your mates. Work together. Look at that, Ryan. Same spot, Another mate. One. Same spot. Get us back, amazing. go back, go back. Amazing. Second car, same spot. Another fish. There's obviously a few of them around, Steve. Yeah. Well, oh, they and can he's get a good fish as well. He is. Are they they can get, get fired up. Oh, he's wolfed Another it. Another one on the crawfish. Have a look. He's thought that's a crayfish and he's gone. Thank you, mother, for the crawfish. There's two fish within a couple of minutes. That's excellent. Got to be careful with copyright around here, you know what I mean? <laughs> that's a beauty. I'm happy. You can see they really do love the fact that those things look like a marron. And uh, that's really why the authorities want to get rid of them because of that fact that they do eat the marron and I can understand that. Just push us back in the light there mate, we'll give everyone a look but yeah look, oh he's all over the place now. Oh, 
The, he's gone up my pants leg now. Oh, <laughs> this escapee. is going to these canoes. Escaping. <laughs> he was burrowing. Oh. Do they generally burrow? No. Not a burrowing fish. No. No, look at that. Fantastic. Redfin perch here in the Warren. We're going to eat well tonight, mate. Mate, that's excellent. Yep, tap, tap, tap. Yep, I'm on. Oh, nice oh, work, yes. mate. He's not a bad go. fish. That's a good old Ben. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think he's as big as your last one. Oh, here he is. Oh, he's a nice perch. Hang on, get away from there. I'll grab him. I'll get that for you. Hey! Oh. Hey! Oh, he Sorry, I thought he was going to get off, but he's well hooked. Don't spike, don't spike me. <laughs> oh. Nice one. That's Look at, four. Oh, jeez. Hang on. Calm down. Relax. Jeez, that's a good fish. It is. It is. Look at that. Beauty. And he's on the crawdad as well. That's a lure, mate. After I got those last two. See, Ryan changed that after I got the last two. We were using different lures. He's changed the crawdad as well. Slightly different type, but pretty similar. That's, that's right. That's obviously the one today. That's it, crawdad's definitely working. You've got the red stripe underneath and I've got the all natural. That's excellent. And that's perch four. Beautiful. <laughs> De-hook him. Just gotta hit there, mate, another one. Oh, you're on again? I am, I am. Just take us around there, mate. Here he comes, here he comes. Yeah, he came out obviously just out of that log there. You can see it just under the water. And there's a log right here too. On the surfers, look at that, it's the biggest oh, one for the day. Excellent. Good fish on the crawdad again. That colour's working, Steve. Look at that. We've done so well here on the Warren River. I tell you what, you told me this was a sensational spot. And a finish on a fish like that, a Jeez. redfin perch on the crawdad. I've had a blast, this is just fantastic. Mate, this is great. Fish, sunshine, beautiful, the Warren River. Excellent. And they're home for a feed of reddies. <laughs>